I don't even know why I'm here. Jimmy. Perth. What's this? What are we doing? A fest for you. Really? Like we don't have a camera or anything, what are we? Oh, we're looking, oh yeah, I forgot, sorry. Oh, we're looking at this, oh no, not this. Um, this. Right. Is, is that a camera? It's, it's a lens, apparently. Someone sent it to me. And they said it's quite good, so shall we look at this? Okay, sure. Is this, oh, is this, ah, oh, it's a really nice hair clip. <laughs> Ah, that's that's what it's for. I was wondering. <laughs> okay, cool. We can look at this today then. Right, what is it called again? <laughs> Sandmark. Today we are looking at a, a new kit on the block for iPhone premium lenses. It's the a company called Sandmark. They sent this to me to have a look at, you know, since they know that I use this a lot for blocking, blocking thing. Mm -hmm. So do you think that's that's the only market or do you think it's like, you know, like obviously a lot of people use like Instagram stories, I do. Um, so do you think it, that would be helpful for, for things like that? Oh, well, definitely, you know, uh, well, you know a lot of people when they do blogging, vlogging, they, what they do, they always use the, the front camera. Yeah. You know, they always hold it like this. You know, there's, there's only a handful of people who have longer arms, you know, which can get a decent kind of angle. Yeah, yeah. So, and the front camera is fixed, obviously. It's not, you know, there's no zoom on it. So these lenses will help you get wider shots. So oh, that means- put them on the front? Yeah, well, it's a clip thing. So that means you can clip it to the back or clip it to the front like this. Oh, cool. So that means when you do it, you know, you get a much wider view and uh, that, will enhance a lot of things you know like particularly you know for ladies or shorter people who've got shorter arms like me so like you know it's it's a wider lens will definitely get you know soak in a lot more like your environment your background things like that so mm -hmm. people will see where you are you know that's what bloggers want you know yeah, they want yeah, they yeah. want to showcase where they are whatever well, they're yeah, doing they get invited to events or they go certain places don't they on purpose to create exactly and, and also you know when they go to party for instance you know you always have a bunch of close friends so you want to get them all into the camera you know if, without this you probably Probably get about three or four people. Well, or you use a selfie stick. Yeah. Which is a health hazard, by the way. Yeah. It's a lot of places ban them these days, don't they? Yeah. Yeah. Or for security reasons, I don't know. Well, also, it's just like people hit them. And yeah, they use it as a weapon. These are weapon. Yeah. So yeah, it, it, your weapons. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> this is an iPhone, and you've still found a way to bring weapons. Well, into look, it. this thing. Feel it. I mean, yeah, this it's is actually pretty. Quite heavy. For how little it is, it's quite heavy. You can hit people with this. Sorry, I keep saying hit people. It's not very good, isn't it? I mean, really? What are you going to do, like? It, get away from me. It, it, that hurts, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, don't, don't report that, please. It's, we're fine. Have to take like if you had a phone case on would you have to take it off for that because obviously that'd be a nightmare because then your phone's like exposed. yeah I, I know it, it can be a nightmare uh it depends on what phone cases you use you know some you know sometimes you get <laughs> sometimes you get these really kind of thick uh bomb proof kind of phone cases yeah yeah well, my yeah yeah like, yeah like otterbox or, or other brands that they have yeah and and they're ultra thick and because you know like for the the optics to work you know it's best to actually have the the lens mm -hmm. as close to your phone lens yeah. as possible so when you have an ultra thick case that may not work too well mm -hmm. uh, but other than that you know like this one has a you know another case on it so you, it's it's very usable just by just clipping on top of it and because it's a clip it works with various different thicknesses yeah so depending you know it doesn't matter what how thick your phone is as long as you can get the the lens as close to your phone lens as possible that will work better so is this the only option the clip is that the only way to get the lens no no if you if you get this uh, you can actually get it with the case yep 
uh, have to have that case here. So this is the case that come with this and of course they have various different cases. I think they at the moment they only have the Apple uh, product kind of cases. So they have the iPhone 10 which I have here, the iPhone 10 case, they have the iPhone 8 and 8 plus cases. Cool. Um, so is that a clippy situation or is that... No, no. Oh, uh, yeah, I forgot to mention that. Yes, this thing actually screws on it. Oh, cool. So like, you can actually unscrew it from the clip. So you so can, you know, like as, a, as a lady, you can actually use it as a proper hair clip. Oh, yeah, I'll put this back. And then you can screw that basically on the case itself. And that's it. You know, that's, that's your phone kind nice. of thing. It's quite heavy. It is. But if you had your phone in it, it would balance it. it, it a, a little bit, you know. But I think this is this is exactly what uh, I always talk about, you know, in premium lenses. And if you haven't checked out some of our previous reviews for you know other premium lenses like the Moment and also the Zeiss, click the link up here. You know, we're going to have some other reviews you haven't seen before. Uh, but it's very similar because these premium lenses they're quite weighty. You know, they're quite yeah. you know. And even if you put a phone on it, it's still a little bit more front heavy if you're not yeah. used to it. And uh, so it, it really comes down to whether you, you know, you're quite getting used to the weight itself when you do filming or photographing uh, with the iPhone. Um, yeah, it's, it's okay, but you just have to get used to the weight. Try not to drop it. My clip's falling out. <laughs> no one told me there would be no other. I was bound to find out along the way. It's okay. I can't even see why I would so we mentioned it's it's quite like weighty. Mm -hmm. it's, it's it's certainly built well. You know, like com it is it compares well. Let's put it that way. it compares well with all the other premium lenses I have reviewed so far, like the Zeiss and the Bitplay and the Moments lenses. They all shape differently, and uh, we're going to do a separate comparison video for for these lenses. But you know, in terms of build quality itself, it's very well put together. You know, it's it's metal. It's glass. It looks nice. It's glass, so that's why it's quite weighty. Mm -hmm. And uh, certainly, certainly very, I don't know, 80s looking. You know, kind of very, really? ang very okay. angular. You know, it doesn't have got any curves or anything like that. It's quite, I don't oh, know. I see what you mean. It's yeah. quite like a square and a circular. It's, way. Like, it's like a, it's like a, I don't like know a, like a bath, like a, these like a bathtub. <laughs> I'm sure. Like a mini bathtub. Oh no, hot tub. It's hot like, tub, a, yeah. like a, like a mini okay. hot tub. Yeah. So yeah, it's a, it's a mini hot tub. Which is kind of quite nice. Uh, the the clip actually, I quite like the clip. The clip is very nice. You know, I, I think that well, the lens is good, but the clip is even better. I mean, it holds my hair really well. Yeah, but it's actually, I think you know, I used a lot of different clips before. Yeah. This is one of the best clips I've ever used. It actually has a little adjustment to it, so you can depending on the angle of the um, the, mm -hmm. the the phone and the and the curve of the phone, you actually adjust. It kind of like it, it will adapt to it. Yeah. quite well so it actually holds it quite securely um, the case however I'm not so impressed about okay yeah and, it's uh, quite thin isn't it yeah the, the case I mean I, I think shit I can't even take it off <laughs> uh, right well I mean I just held it it's, it's quite like it's, it's thin um, and, and it doesn't like cover the top does it yeah it doesn't it doesn't cover like all four uh, four sides completely it's, and it's really hard to get out not that it's actually very secure, but it's, 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 it's very thin, mm. you know. Uh, it doesn't offer much in the way of protection, does it, I guess? It looks good, but then, um, yeah, it's, it's very thin, very slim. And, and I guess, you know, if you really want a slim case, it's this definitely one of them. Uh, but I don't think, yeah, it doesn't... Yeah, so like if you were vlogging and you were at a big event, and you're worried about your camera maybe being knocked out of your your hand. Or, this isn't maybe going to protect your phone. But this was quite good. That's that's when you, really good. When you dropped this earlier, <laughs> yeah, it, it, it lasted quite well. I was quite impressed. Yes, yes, and I so your phone wouldn't do very well, but the lens is fine. Yeah, I guess so. Just carry a spare phone, I guess. Insure it. Insure your phones, people. <laughs> yeah, but when you block it, unless you've got two phones, you know, when you drop one. I guess one. so. Yep. Yeah. So yeah, it's it's not. It doesn't offer much protection mm -hmm. by any means. And yeah, that that's good. I, I do like the clip. The clip is definitely one of the best. They should actually just sell the clips. Just sell the wow. Yeah, and you can use a hair clip. Yeah, it's great. Hi. So this is what this is this is what blogging is all about, isn't it? So this is a random people jumping into my frame. Yeah. Yeah. But like, look. This is the wire lens. Let's stick this on. Whoa, look at that. Oh, yeah. 
Yeah. That's a lot wider. Look at that. That's that's that cool, is isn't cool. it? That yeah. is cool. That is really cool. That's not bad at all. You can see more of what I'm wearing. <laughs> Although that was slipping down. <laughs> yeah, right. look how close that is. Let's let's try that again. Um, I need to get that get that on properly. But you see, I have to get it really dead center. Otherwise, it's going to be blue. Hey, I see you again, and it's still slipping. I think it's my glass. It's the glass back of the iPhone 10 that's causing it. Yeah, it's going really blue now. It's slipping down. Yeah, it's not, it's not gripping very well with the glass things. Look what just happened. Yeah, there's a lot more. Yeah, but it's actually a lot better now. It's more secure with my leather case. Yeah. Yeah, it, so that, that grippy grip that I like about doesn't work very well with the glass of the iPhone 10. Yeah, but I mean, that is slippy. <laughs> <laughs> like, slippy. Yeah. <laughs> Slippery. Okay. okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's true, it's true. But it works, you know, like yeah. the, the, with the front camera, it's, it's definitely quite good. She, she likes the wind. It makes her look so much more dramatic. <laughs> she's, she's definitely a Hollywood princess. Ah, oh, thanks. Yeah, you see. See, that's just, this is what this is like. Let's take it off to see the comparison again. Yep. There you go. Ooh. Oh, my Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't ready. <laughs> oh wow, look at that. Oh my god. Now the slip back on. Oh, there you go. God, it makes a big difference, isn't it? It was. That was really This is this is a really good vlogging distance, you know, like you, yeah. you can see half body and then it's it's great. Yeah, you know. so if you're at an event like we said before, if you're at an event wherever. You've got a bunch of friends you can come out and just yeah, say hey! Hi. That's cool. Cool, yeah, so it doesn't work very well with the the slippy glass case. Way too late, but I just can't get my eyes off of you. Maybe we will regret this, but tomorrow is another day. So it looks quite nice, it feels quite nice. Obviously, you're a big fan of the clip. Yeah. Um, but I haven't seen any of the photos, so what do you what do you think of the like image quality? It, it actually it's actually quite good. And I think, you know, over the last uh, year and a half. Uh, since the Zeiss, you know, the original Zeiss uh, uh, lens came out, that's kind of like labelled as the first ever uh, premium optics for smartphones. Uh, and every other manufacturer is starting to step up the games and they're producing their version of the premium lenses. Um, uh, like one of the first one was uh, Moment, they, they, they stepped up, you know, they, they designed a new uh, Moment Y lens, then Bitplay started with the premium lens. Uh, Sandmark is new, so this is actually the, 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 the first kind of uh, premium lens for it and they, they actually made it quite well and, and I've, you know, I've done shots with it, it's actually quite nice. and close very close to you know in terms of optical perfections you know very close to Zeiss I kind of think that it will beat it you know pure optical greatness from that and uh, uh, but it's it certainly performs and from the pricing point of view and I think it actually stacks up very well and it, it will match definitely the big play lens or the moment lens in terms of optical quality so it's actually it's actually quite quite good and sharp another season may leave me quite a few lenses um, would you recommend this one at, you know for vlogging or photography um, on your iPhone uh, the answer is a complicated one I mean I, I would recommend it optically and you know, like I said this compares well with uh, the likes of moment and uh, bit play uh, not I still think you know like not quite the size level and uh, but you know, it's selling half the price of size, mm -hmm. and uh, so it's it's actually very decent. Um, but you have to think about you know if you want to use more uh, your iPhone for blogging vlogging thing mm -hmm. uh, it's more like getting into a brand uh, like a camera brand like you want you want to choose a uh, like Nikon Canon Fuji or Olympus or any other brands that you're thinking about um, the reason I'm saying is because they all have different mounting system yeah exactly yeah so this is this is the only thing you have to think about uh, like this particular one the Sandmark has a very big kind of a uh, 
screw mount, uh, which is different to Zeiss, different to BitPlay, different but to see, Moments. I've seen them though, and they, they like are a little clip-in thing. So if you go to a lot of these big events, something like this yeah. is a lot more secure, I think. So if someone if someone knocks one of the other ones, I would always have a little worry that maybe if they knocked it hard enough, it'd come off. Whereas with that, yeah. it's like, it's a massive screw system, so it's going to be really hard to get out. It, it, yeah, it, it is. I mean, it's, 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 I think they're all generally quite secure. Mm. And, and uh, But I think, you know, like in terms of recommendation, uh, you have to think about, you know, branding wise, you know, like at the moment, Sandmark, uh, I know in their website, they have a few different lenses uh, to offer, you know, uh, the wide one that we're looking at now, just uh, just one of the premium lenses. Uh, they have telephoto, they have macro lenses, just like any other uh, companies. Uh, but they're, they're relatively new in terms of iPhone iPhone lens market. Moment's been around for a while. Uh, Bitplay has spent a lot of effort designing not just the, the lenses, but also the cases. Mm -hmm. So uh, they are more established in that sense. So um, I would recommend it optically, you know, but you have to make the decision whether you want to go ahead with this system. You have to think about, you know, in, if you're going to use it for, you know, for a lot, for a long time, and uh, you might want to think about, you know, in terms of uh, after sales or maybe like how long they're going to support the system. The reason I say that because uh, Zeiss, you know, I believe they actually stopped developing uh, uh, the system for smartphone now. So the lenses that we're reviewing now is actually possibly the only lens they're ever going to produce for iPhones. Right. Um, so so you have to think about that. You know, Moment is still actually continuing investing into the whole ecosystem. So is BitPlay. So they, they are designing new cases and new lenses for each generation of phones and things like that. So you have to think about that. So Sandmark is good. The lens that I've, I like the lens a lot. Um, but how long are they going to last? You know, that's the big question. So I guess it's like when you choose your phone, right? Yeah. So when you're choosing a phone for your vlogging, you choose Samsung or you choose an iPhone or whatever you, brand yeah, yeah and then you stick usually stick with that so that you've got all your editing and things and you're used to it cool. so it's a, it's a similar concept then i guess like it, it, making it is, the yeah. investment hopefully for the long term yep so do your research yeah exactly and you know the clip is definitely more versatile than a case because yep. you know when you upgrade your your phone you need a new case but a clip you can just clip it to any other yeah. things uh, but I'm, I'm more looking at more possibly the future investment of the company where they're going to continue developing the lenses if let's say a new optical formula going to come out make it sharper nicer whether they're going to invest and continue pushing the technology forward coffee cups and cigarettes laying around the room I don't mind a little mess just want to stay with you when we if you liked the video you just saw remember to do this give us a thumbs up and click the subscribe button also click the little bell so you get a notification whenever there's a new one and uh, my links are there too We've just woken Jimmy up, so just bear with him a couple of minutes. We will get there. That's it, yeah. Right. So we have an iPhone lens coming here. Coming back to you now? Yes, it's all yeah. come natural now. Celine Dion did a song called Can't All Coming Back To Me Now. I feel like that should be playing for your life. When right you now. mention Celine Dion, I always think about a Titanic song. Yeah, it's a good song. This is it. Send I'm flying. Ciao. Smartphone. Premium Y lens. <laughs> what that are you doing? <laughs> That's a long intro. <laughs> ah. oh, hurt my ear. <laughs> good at clapping. <laughs> so you, if you haven't followed my, ugh, you haven't followed my. Um, today we're looking at Sandmark. Uh, Sandmark's Y lens. Wide. Wide. Yeah. So oh, cool. you say what it actually says wide lens on it. Oh cool. Yeah. Okay. So are you are we going? Have you got? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> no, I'm just I forgot what I was gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it it looks quite nice. Sorry. Okay. Are you alright? <laughs> yeah, I'm alright. Can all right. I go? Yes, you can. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> They're a pink. Maybe I'm pink. Am I pink? Dun -dun -dun -dun. Am I pink? Dun -dun 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 I like I like the pink panther. 
Oh, you're pink. Yeah, okay. I'm pink. Just... Uh, not eh, 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 eh. One more time. <laughs> I'm not in front today. I'm so bad. I'm so bad. I'm not myself. Baby, hit me one more time. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, I was different song. <laughs> If you liked the video you just saw, remember to click the subscribe button and give us a thumb up and uh, turn, on, turn, turn, on, turn on the notification. <laughs> Slip, slippy, 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 car, slippy Very glass back. Slippy. Yep. Cool, awesome. <laughs> I can't believe you got that. <laughs>